conditions for simple harmonic motion. Do you know the difference between vibratory motion and simple harmonic motion? If you don't know, let me explain it to you. Vibratory motion is to and fro motion of an object about its mean position which may be random or regular. While simple harmonic motion is the vibratory motion which is regular and periodic in nature. This means that simple harmonic motion is a type of vibratory motion. More about periodicity in the video link given in the description box below. Thus, to maintain that regular and periodic motion of simple harmonic motion, special conditions and specific setup is required to execute it. Thus, to maintain that regular and periodic motion of simple harmonic motion, special conditions should be fulfilled. Let me explain about the conditions through a simple example of simple pendulum system. Consider Bob of mass M tied with a massless string which is an ideal case but assume it to be our setup anyways. The body moves from mean or equilibrium position O to its first extreme position, position A. When the mass reaches A, the restoring force on the bob increases with the increase in displacement. Thus, obeying Hooke's law. Therefore, first condition for the body to execute SHM is elastic restoring force and the second one is the law of elasticity or Hooke's law. Now, due to the restoring force, M moves from A to the equilibrium position O, but it doesn't stop. Why? This is because of inertia of motion that the body of mass M is resisting its change in state of motion and it continues to move towards the other extreme position, position B, due to the increased velocity and inertia of motion at the mean position. Again, the elastic restoring force at B increases, therefore increasing the acceleration as said by the Newton's second law of motion formula that is F is equals to MA where the acceleration is directly proportional to the force applied. Therefore, when the restoring force will increase, the acceleration will automatically increase. Thus, the third and fourth conditions to execute SHM is inertia and acceleration respectively. If any one of the condition is not fulfilled, body cannot execute this type of motion. Quiz. Is every periodic motion simple harmonic motion? Get to know about this from the description box below. Also find some other examples of periodic motion that is not SHM and share it with your friends in the comment section below smart end. You can remember these conditions effortlessly by only remembering the Hooke's law that is F is equals to minus kx where the elastic restoring force increases with the increase in displacement from the mean position also with the increase in acceleration as mass m reaches the extreme position where the restoring force and acceleration both are in the same direction and they are directed towards the mean position O. And due to inertia of motion, the mass M does not stop at mean position which plays a very very significant role in the continuous to and fro motion of simple harmonic motion. You just need to remember Hooke's law formula. If you understood the conditions, like and share this video with your classmates. Thank you for watching. Till next time, Smartitude. Learn fast, adapt well.